But I will test the young man's um, vociferous persistence. Cheers to you. you. You'll go far, I'm sure. Keep playing. Don't let this rejection get you down. It's just me being an asshole. You got it. This is all you. You got it. Let it fuel you to prove me wrong. Say, that motherfucker. Someday I'm going to meet him in a studio. Oh, I'll be giving an award to the best group. Best drummer ever. And I'll say, remember me? I'm that fucker that you told me I lived at home still. <laughs> well, guess what, Ed? I just bought my mama house. So fuck you. <laughs> hey, we got word. Um, you know, we get many gracious, gracious letters. And some of them hit home. I mean, one of them, there's so many people that have seen the band a number of times, which is why when I said that's the first mistake I've ever made, they were like, yeah, that's bullshit. And there's a guy out in the audience tonight named Jed Garfunkel, and this is his 100th show. We, uh, we are humbled beyond belief, and, um, and, and, but we also feel a responsibility. So, um, and this guy says he's been at 40 shows and, and still doesn't own a tambourine. Okay, I'll work on that. Um, but, you know, we hope that we, you know, it feels like we have a relationship. And, and I feel, or whether it's true or not, we do feel like we earn your trust or should do everything we can to earn your trust and have this conversation and having a musical conversation, a meaningful conversation, and, and it's never something we take for granted. And, you know, while we might sell t-shirts, because we like t-shirts too, um, and, and maybe hats, and, you know, it's interesting because, you know, politicians, they sell t-shirts and hats and buttons, it's tradition, and, and flags, and, and, oh, maybe even gym shoes, or gold, and then, um, maybe even, oh, yeah, well, I was going to say NFTs, non-fungible tokens, which, that translates in, um, not worth a shit, I think that's the translation, and, and, and Bibles, you said it, yeah, Bibles. I, I know that because I got one. I, I got one of the Bibles because I, I, I wanted to, you know, it, it was, it, it included the Constitution and the Pledge of Allegiance and the Bill of Rights in the Bible. Which, because I forget sometimes that Jesus was American. But there it was. And, But I was excited when it arrived because I got my exacto knife and, and I was going to cut out the Constitution. I was going to cut out the Bill of Rights just to exercise, you know, the separation of church and state. And then I shut it, feeling like I had done something worthwhile, only to be further frustrated by the American flag embossed with a name on the front, and USA on the front of a holy Bible. So that was an exercise of frustration. There was no separation. But now, then there's crypto. Now there's crypto. Trading cards. No, she's, I'll, I'll quote her, fucking trading cards. Some valuable ones with little scraps of a blue suit. Oh my God. Now, this week, this is, okay, this is why I was like, okay, I got to fucking, we got to talk about this, because this is a little, a couple days ago, ladies and gentlemen, for the low price of $100,000, you can own a, a gold watch, a gold watch. They are selling the same person who is every day telling us that citizens in America cannot afford eggs is somehow selling $100,000 watches. Good point, Eddie, good point. 
So which one is it? Maybe his friends can. Who am I talking about anyways? I, I, I don't want to offend anybody, so we'll just leave it open. But, okay, you know what? And I should clarify, because there's the $100,000 version. There's also the $500 version. Those of you on a budget. So, so, but I was thinking, almost like in an Oprah moment, you know, that I, I, I wish I could, I could buy everyone here a $500 watch. And because I think it really is just as a symbol, it would be a symbol of, of that it's because it's about time. It's, it's about this election is about time and, and it's about precious time and this precious planet. And and it's about time that we say we're not going to take this anymore. We're not going to take this bullshit anymore. We need lifting and not grifting. <laughs>